Many companies are looking for more workers, but the selection of those workers is getting pretty thin. Local News 8's Evan Thomason examines this concern and shows us how job fairs are trying to help. The Idaho Department of Labor invited many companies to their job fair in the Walmart parking lot in Idaho Falls on Wednesday. We're a long haul over the road trucking company uh, delivering goods to all different parts around the country. We design and manufacture equipment to plant, harvest, transport and store potatoes, sugar beets and, and other vegetables. Many employers brought their job applications. However, fewer future employees showed up. Right now, the unemployment rate is really low. There are a lot of businesses that are looking for good qualified employees. The unemployment rate in the state of Idaho in June was only 2.7 percent. This makes it difficult for these companies to fill their positions. It does, however, make it easier for people to find a job. I've seen a lot of potential employers. People have been really kind about telling me about all the things that they can do, all the things that they can offer for different types of positions at different companies. Working at like a processing plant for any kind of machinery is always really cool. And going into college for, I'm going to major in mechanical engineering, so that's like right up my alley. Another employer overheard this interview with Dominic. So as soon as the interview was completed, Dominic was quickly brought in by that employer to get an application. These recruiters need their open positions filled right away. The trades, in-demand jobs is what we are looking for to get people into, like uh, CDL and get into trucking or construction. I'm looking to fill immediately. Uh, we've got a, a large need, especially for drivers. There's a large driver shortage out there and trying to uh, fulfill those needs to uh, keep our customers happy. Companies are in fierce competition for the scarce people remaining. That's why some will do whatever it takes to reel in these job seekers, including providing exclusive training. This is the weld test that we have incoming welders um, do to just show us what their base is. So this is an example of a good one. This is an example of a weld test where someone needs to go back and do some more training. Reporting in Idaho Falls, I'm Evan Thomason.